Hi, this is Bob Binkley for the Bucks County Gilbert and Sullivan Society. You just heard our music director, Lee Millis, play The Lost Chord, written by Arthur Sullivan in 1877. He played it on a parlor organ that he owns that was built in the 1870s. Hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you look up the words. They're quite stirring. Well, we may have lost our 2020 season. Um, you're aware of that, but we've decided to try to collect some videos from our talented members of chorus and leads and make it a kind of a holiday present for our members and our audience. I uh, hope you enjoy this. And I hope you enjoy your holidays. I hope you stay safe and look for us in the spring when uh, Lee and Henry Heyman and I will bring you a full production of The Sorcerer. Hi, I'm Abby Capitolo. I will be playing Aline in the production of The Sorcerer that we will hopefully be putting on next year. And I am in Bob's barn here with some set pieces from The Sorcerer. Behind me, we've got some beautiful costumes just waiting to be put on by willing actors. And we've got some flax that are going to be used to build the sets. We're really excited to get those going into what they are going to be. We're really excited. That's an arch. That'll, that's part of the set design. That's our mascot. Oh, and we've got our bucket of props here. I think this is pretty important. <laughs> we really hope to see all of you back in June for The Sorcerer. We're going to do it, hopefully. Um, stick with us. And we've got some really, really wonderful performances from some of our members that we're excited for you to see. We've got Sarah Folsom Kovarik, and we've got the wonderful Lily Cull, and our dear Wilbur Lewis, and Julie May, who you must know. And we've got Tim Faulkner, who will be my boyfriend in the upcoming Sorcerer. We've got Derek Hess, who will be the Sorcerer. Gabriel Nathan was our Jack Point in the Real Men of the Guard production that we had a couple years ago. And we've got a guest performance from James Strigley, and we've got a performance from Dennis Kloppel. I hope you guys enjoy. Thanks.
how lovely, how lovely is the surpassingly lovely is the plainest of them. What grace, what delicacy, what refinement in Ruth. Ruth told me she was beautiful. <laughs> Me. I have deceived you. Yes, deceived me. You told me you were fair as gold. And the master, am I not so? But now I see you're plain and old. I'm sure I'm not a chunk so. Upon my innocence you play. I'm not the one to hold so. Your face is lined, your hair is gray. I can't compare to Valley Thank you. 
but vengeance pursues. They are heating the cauldron. Ah! The cat is shall behold! The sun feet at your feet! Cat shall mercy! Have you, have you mercy on him? See here, you have slain my love. He did not love me, but he would have loved me in time. I am the quiet taste. <laughs> Only the educated palate can appreciate me, and I was educating his palate when he left me. Well, he is dead. And where shall I find another? It takes years to train myself. <laughs> machinations, sings a tender love song of sorts to Katisha, in which a little Tom Tit, a bird native to New Zealand, is rejected by his proffered love, and thus, suffering from blighted affection, plunges himself into the billowy wave below to his death. Enjoy the bird instead. <laughs> did he really die of love? He really did. All the count of a cruel little hand? Yes. Oh, poor little chap. It's an affecting tale, and quite true. I knew the bird intimately. <gasps> did, did you? He must have been very fond of her. Oh, his devotion was something extraordinary. Oh, poor little chap. Mm. And, and, if I refuse you, you will go and do the same? At once. No, 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 no. Anything but that. Oh. I am a silly little goose, aren't I? Huh? <laughs> and you won't hate me if I'm just a teeny weeny wee bit bloodthirsty, will you? Hate you? Uh oh, Katisha. Is there not beauty even in bloodthirstiness? <laughs> My idea. Exactly. <laughs> If you ever go across the sea to Ireland, then maybe at the closing of your day, you can sit and watch the moon rise over Clada and see the sun go down on Galway Bay. Just to hear again the ripple of the trout stream, the women in the meadow making hay, just to sit beside the turf fire in the cabin and watch the barefoot gossens as they play. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, 
the breezes blowing o'er the sea from Ireland are perfumed by the heather as they flow. And the women in the uplands digging praties speak a language that the strangers do not know. Yet the strangers came and tried to teach us their ways, and they scorned us just for being what we are. But they might as well go chasing after moonbeams or light a penny candle from a star. And if there is going to be a life hereafter, and faith somehow I'm sure there's going to be, I will ask my God to let me make my heaven in that dear land across the Irish Sea. And I'll ask my God to let me make my heaven in my dear land across the Irish Sea. times when words like Zoom school have entered all of our daily conversations, I think this is an excellent opportunity for us to do something educational as well. So here's a little song to educate and enlighten us all. arsenic, aluminum, selenium, and hydrogen, and oxygen, and nitrogen, and rhenium, and nickel, neodymium, neptunium, germanium, and iron, pamiracium, ruthenium, uranium, europium, zirconium, lutetium, vanadium, and lanthanum, and osmium, and acetine, and radium, and gold, procatimium, and indium, and gallium, <gasps> and iodine, and thorium, and thulium, and thallium. There's yttrium, ictrium, actidium, rubidium, and boron, gadolidium, niromium, iridium, and strontium, and silicon, and silver, and samarium, and bismuth, and lithium, beryllium, and barium. 
I hope you're taking good notes, as there will be a test later. There's holium and helium and hafnium and erbium and phosphorus and francium and fluorine and terbium and manganese and mercurium and lepidium and magnesium, dysprosium and cesium and cerium and cesium and lead, presium, dimium and platinum, plutonium, palladium, promethium, potassium, polonium and tantalum, titanium, titanium, tellurium, and cadmium, calcium and chromium and curium. There's sulfur, californium and fermium. Helium and also mendelevium, anthidium, nobelium, and argon, krypton, neon, radon, xenon, zinc, and rhodium, and chlorine, carbon, cobalt, copper, constant, and sodium. These are the only ones of which the news has come to Harvard, and there may be many others, but they haven't been discovered. 